hello welcome to my channel for another video we are at vlogmas day 15 i cannot believe we are already 15 days into vlogmas that is just so crazy to me we only have 10 days left and i'm honestly like i'm not ready i am not ready to say goodbye i feel like this christmas has like flown on by also we're starting the vlog off in the car if you didn't know on vlogmas day one i announced that i ended up selling my car well not selling my car ended up trading it in not not even turning it in what's the word turning it in because my lease is up and i ultimately decided like not to purchase the car out or like keep it or whatever i had a land rover discovery and for the price and the luxury of the car like it was a beautiful car don't get me wrong i just felt like there was like certain things with the car that wasn't like matching with the price point and also it was a huge car we're also new here we just moved to austin texas from san antonio and the roads here are crazy and they are so narrow that i was literally getting anxiety driving on these dang streets like my car was literally parked at our apartments i didn't even drive it for maybe like a month and i was like this is literally pointless it just like makes no sense to have the car so we ended up doing what we had to do with that and now my husband and i are sharing a car whenever we go anywhere he drives like i never ever drive i'm passenger princess for life i i don't drive when he's here and then when i've gone with my friend somewhere she's picked me up so it's like i'm never ever driving so it feels so weird to drive i also feel so much more safer in this car it's a smaller car so I feel like driving it here like on these roads i just i just love it i love it so much more my previous car was so big that i feel like i couldn't like really fit into places it just feels so nice driving a small car again so i love it i love our little smoky but i am here at academy to get matthew some christmas presents i'm not gonna only shop here i have a couple other stores in mind and matthew if you're watching this is your cue to get off the vlog also let's be real all of the like gift guides i've seen on tiktok and instagram my husband would never ever ever go for those things like he's not the kind of guy that wants all these like bougie high-end things like he's just a blue collar man simple simple guy he loves his carhartt shirts he loves his wrangler jeans and his tacovas like that is it and i feel like for every christmas or birthday i always buy him clothes because he never buys clothes for himself he will literally wear the same clothes all year until like one thing gives out like he never i don't know why he never wants to shop for himself it is like the strangest thing like if we're at a store i have to like pull teeth to be like come look at this or let's look at that like let's get you a shirt or something and like if i don't buy it he won't buy it so normally for christmas and birthdays i basically get him a whole new wardrobe i had wanted to get him hogas but he just got those i think i want to get him a couple like carhartt shirts maybe carhartt sweatshirt i think i also want to get him like a columbia hoodie one that he has now is one that i got him two christmases ago two years ago i got it for him and it just needs to be replaced it's like not soft anymore at all i was also wanting to get him a lululemon sweatsuit set only because like i know that lululemon is like bougie i love lululemon i am just like a lululemon stan it's expensive very expensive especially for a matching set it would have been like 300 dollars, and he deserves it he does but i just don't know if like how he's gonna feel about it i know he would much rather prefer like carhartt or columbia as opposed to lululemon but i've been trying to get him to try lululemon and he just will not buy it for himself so maybe i'll buy like one of the things see how he likes it and we'll go from there or maybe just like a pair of shorts because he always wears shorts even if it's cold outside so we'll see but anywho i'm rambling i want to go inside and see what they have i also might get him a new yeti too but i also picked up a coffee this morning because i had like so many gift cards i finally am able to use my new koozie i literally do not buy coffee out ever since i got my nespresso so i was like i have to use her it is just so so cute i love all the colors but enough chit chatting let's go inside i was like struggling to find the car her section it was not over in the men's and i was like where the heck is it but i found it all the way in the back i actually really like this hoodie here i don't know if i should get him black or gray zombie one that he has now is like that green color i feel like he might like black better i don't know decisions i wanted to get this when i found his size but i don't like the arms it's like a neon green i feel like that totally ruins it so i think i'm gonna go just for the black ones i had no idea they had carhartt sweatpants <gasps> oh my god okay i'm going to get these two so these are like the only t-shirts i see but they're like those soft ones and he likes like the really thick carhartt shirts so like these are all super thin like oh my god i love this for me this is so cute they have like the traditional carhartt color and they have that green one over there too so far i got two pairs of sweatpants a sweatshirt and a t-shirt that i found let's go look at the yetis i mean the columbia section i really wanted to get him a yeti like the new 40 ounce ones with the big handle but they don't even have oh wait is this it no it's 30 ounce i have more back here 
Man, that stinks because I really wanted one of those Yetis for me too. I only have the 35 ounce. Or is that the size? Is it 35 ounce or did I think it was 40? Okay, so I just looked online and the one I'm looking for is a 42 ounce Yeti. It's this one. Not that good for him. But the biggest they have is just the 35 ounce. It's cute, but it's not big enough. Keep Next stop is Target. Hopefully the music's not too loud, but guys, they have new Stanleys at Target. These are so cute. So I had wanted to get this for him too in like this like nice cream color. He tried it on when we came and of course he did not buy it, but it looks so good on him. Now they don't have it, so I don't know if I should do this color, but I really like the way the cream one looked. Cut oh, hello, it's right here. Oh my god, okay. Let's see if they have his size. Of course, they do not have his size. So let's keep looking for something else. I'm just gonna grab some poppies because we're out. I normally get the value pack from Costco, but this will hold me over. I'm also gonna grab one of these magnesium sticks from Ashley Tistel's line. It's this tripod my friend has it, and I love how like compact it is. So it needs to be good for vlogging. Back in the car, sorry if my energy was like really low inside Target. It was so packed in there that I got a little bit overwhelmed but it's to be expected it's Friday at three o'clock so it was just so busy so 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 busy but I didn't find anything for Matthew there I literally got stuff like just for me but I am here at Old Navy I want to see what Old Navy has I also just ordered myself a salad from Texas Roadhouse the salads from Texas Roadhouse are my favorite they're so good they're probably like not even healthy at all but it'll be ready at 327 so i have 20 minutes um inside old navy and the texas roadhouse is like right down the street so um i just wanted to come kill some time and see what else they had i was thinking of going to home goods because there's a home goods here too and a marshall's next door but i really don't need to be spending my money on home decor i need to buy christmas gifts so Let's go see what Onidi has. I don't know if you can tell all that well, but it's also like really gloomy out. I think it's gonna rain. I could feel a light drizzle. Okay, the music was so loud in Old Navy, and I found one shirt that I really like for Matthew, but it didn't have his size, but I found it online. So I'm gonna order it online also. It is drizzling. And my order at the Cassette House is ready. So let's go get it. Just got home and this is my salad from texas roadhouse it is seriously so good i was in traffic for the longest time getting home so i'm gonna pop the chicken in the air fryer but trust me guys if you haven't had the chicken critter salad get it it's delicious matthew has officially left work so i can actually show you guys what i got him from academy today oh, i also will give you guys a haul of everything that i got from target as well i don't know how the footage came out because like i said the music was like really loud inside there I was like trying to vlog, but the music's loud, and then like you can't have music on your vlogs like for copyright reasons. So I don't even know if that was included in the vlog or what or how it came out. So I'll just show you guys regardless. But I did get Matthew two pairs of sweatpants, a t-shirt, and a new hoodie. I was gonna get him a Columbia hoodie, but I actually like the Carhartt ones a lot better. The first sweatpant I got him are these relaxed fit tapered sweatpants. This is the black one, and they're so so nice. Matthew is like really picky about his sweatpants and I think they're tapered. He likes them really baggy but I like the tapered because like I don't know it looks nice but we'll see. If he doesn't like them he can return them. So I got him this black color. I also got him a gray one. Well same exact one just in gray. So I thought like you know just neutral colors and then to kind of have like a little matching set I got him the hoodie, it's just the black hoodie. And this one is called the Loose Midweight Logo Sleeve Graphic Sweatshirt. And then I did get him one shirt. But he didn't have any of like the really thick Carhartt shirts that he likes to wear for work, like the really like heavy duty ones. He had the flame resistant ones, but that's like not what he needs. But I did get him this one just to wear like casual. And it's like this really nice Carhartt one, but it has like the Texas logo on it. It's really cool. This is just like a casual shirt. And I think I also want to go and get him like a gift card, maybe to like Dick's or something. Because they didn't have any other shirts there that I was looking for. I don't know if it's because it got sold out or they just don't carry those ones there. So I think I'll get him a gift card to Dick's so we can pick out the shirts that he wants. Um, so that's pretty much all that I got for him so far. I think I do want to get him a pair of Lululemon shorts. But if you guys have any other suggestions on what to get your husband that has everything, 
please let me know because I still need more suggestions. But moving on to Target. So I think I figured out what's wrong with my foot. One of my friends messaged me. She's like my second parent, I swear. Her and her husband are our second parents. Like we love them so much. But she messaged me saying that I have a bone spur or something like that. Oh my gosh, you guys. I thought because I hadn't been walking on it for the past like two days. So I've really been at home. So I've been like walking on like my tippy toes. Cause I thought it was like better this morning when I woke up. I was like, oh, I don't really feel it. I went out today and I could feel the pain. It hurts so bad. So I think I have what's called a bone spur. I don't know how it formed, how it happened. It is very, very painful. So she told me to get a magnesium stick. She sent me like a link of this like company that she loves. She said that it takes a while to ship, especially for the holidays. So I got this magnesium stick to tie me over. I got this one. It's a Soothe and Comfort Cashmere Vanilla Soothing Body Serum Stick. And it's infused with magnesium. I thought I could like rub this on my heel before I go to bed or just like honestly whenever. I also did get that little tripod, which you guys are actually on right now. It's so much better. This was my other tripod. And the uh, this one that I'm filming on is literally like this big it's like half the size it's just so much more easier more compact this one is already compact enough but the one that i'm actually filming on is just 10 times better i can link the one that i'm using right now because it is a really good handy tripod especially if you are a content creator and it also came with like a little mount for your phone here like a little attachment did also pick up this sweater it is so cute super super soft and i love like the mock neck on it i have no idea what this says if anyone knows what this means please let me know i think it's like french for something but i have no idea but i thought it was really cute and festive i also got something from amazon that i'm just like hoping it fits you guys it is a black skirt which i thought would actually be really cute with this sweater and like some tights and it just looks so cute it looks really short that's always like my worry when i get like skirts is that they're gonna be like really short on me and normally things that are just short in general they're extra short on me because my butt is so big that it like rides up in the back i will try it on but it's like this really cute little black skirt actually it's like a little squirt has shorts that's all i pretty much got oh I also got some lashes from Target and a small case of Poppy because I have to do a Costco restock. That's all that I got from my little shopping adventure today. It's currently 5.33 p.m. My foot hurts so, so bad. I just want to like take my makeup off and like rub this magnesium stuff on my foot and pray it helps. I took some Tylenol earlier when I got home, so hopefully that kicks in soon. I just tried on that skirt and sweater together. Also, don't mind my mirror. I know it's really, really dirty. I have to clean it. This skirt is so cute and it is so comfortable, you guys. Also with this sweater, I love how it looks. It does fit me a little bit short in the back, but I can just like wear some tights and it'll be fine. I would not wear this without tights, that's for sure, because it is like super short, but it is so comfy. Then there's even other colors. I might even order another color. I love this. I will have this linked in my description box for you guys. It's Hallmark movie time, and for tonight's movie, I think I'm gonna watch this one. It's called An Ice Palace Romance. And it says, a journalist faces old fears when she returns to her hometown ice rink to cover a story. With the help of the owner and his young daughter, she begins to reevaluate her life's purpose. All right, let's give her a watch. It's also raining outside, you guys. It's so nice and gloomy and dark. And I also have yet to fix the lights over there. I think I can replace them, but the extra lights are in my storage unit. So I'll just look for Matthew so we can do that when he's off. But let's watch this movie. Did I just door dash snacks? Yes. Yes, I did. Let's hope and pray. It was from 7-Eleven, if you guys know the fiasco last time. And you know, we just pray everything is right this time. <gasps> okay, so we tried these for the first time like a couple weeks ago. They are so good. I had never, ever, ever had these before. Here we go. <sighs> I also got these. I never had these either, but Matthew got these. They're super sour gushers. They're a little stuck together. I still am watching that movie. It's actually so, so cute. It is kind of like cheesy and rom com -y, but it's like a cute, cheesy rom com -y. I really like it. I'm like halfway through, and I will definitely update you guys when it's done. But I still have so much laundry to fold, you guys. I will show you guys when I'm done. But today, I don't know if it's like the weather or... Your girl's tired, okay? Your girl is tired. But we're gonna... 
I was just saying about how I was tired and my Google I could hear in the room. She said, you deserve rest. Oh my God, it's so creepy. Hey Google, what did you say? Sure, that's because you've been working so hard. You deserve to rest. Hey Google, what did you just say? Sure, that's because you've been working so hard. You deserve to rest. How do I turn I'm gonna unplug it. I'm so sorry, Google. I have to unplug you. I have the chills. That was so freaking weird. I'm not well right now. Is that normal? Can someone tell me if that was normal? That was so weird. Okay, I gotta go. <laughs> Just finished the movie and it was actually super cute. I really did like it a lot. I'm gonna spoil it. So if you don't wanna know what happens, skip ahead to this number here. But the ending, like it was obviously like a romance, like very super cliche, but I like how it ended with them like not getting married or like establishing that like they're a couple like just ended normally and it was super cute. Cause you know, like all Hallmark movies end with like a wedding, a proposal, they're together after like knowing each other for a few days and it's just like so unrealistic. I mean, if you know, you know, but does every storyline have to be that way? You know what I mean? This one, I liked how it was just like, okay, like, you know, I'm here for you, you're here for me, that's it. And it was like super cool. Obviously like you tell they're still together, but it was just done in a different way. Very cute movie, I did like it. It was called A Christmas Palace of Romance. It's on Hallmark and I think it just came out. It's currently now 9.13 p.m. I feel like it's so early, but it's like so late, you know what I mean? I have so, oh my God, let me look, look at Ranger. Oh my God, he looks so cute. Are you just watching me vlog? <laughs> Why are you so cute? Oh my goodness, look at that puppy. Oh no, oh no, he's gonna come over here. <gasps> That's a big stretch. Look at that stretch. I feel like this vlog is giving off like so much chaotic energy. This is gonna be just a pain to edit. Also, if you do like content or like vlog, you can tell when a vlog is gonna be hard to edit because I've just been like stumbling on my words and I've been having to like stop and start, stop and start. So I'm like, oh, this is gonna be really fun to edit. I think this is gonna be a fun vlog in general. Hopefully you guys like it. But I do have some laundry to do. I'm just thinking I might end the vlog here. Let me just show you guys my pile of laundry. Like I just know I need a moment to just do this. I don't know why this entire week just been putting off the laundry like I don't know what it is I am never that way I used to like never understand people that would be like I hate laundry because like all you do is throw it in the washing machine but I have been putting it off literally all day and if I finally like wash a load I won't put it up it'll just stay in the basket and I'm like picking clothes out of the basket I don't know why it doesn't make any sense but let me show you my pile come with me okay it's actually not that bad now that I'm looking at it it's really not that bad it's not but do you guys want to see like yeah, this is, I, I can't even like close it or open it all the way. Yeah, I, it's just so bad. This closet definitely needs to be like reorganized. Lighting in my closet is actually not that bad. I've never thought to like bring y'all in here. This could be fun for like a little decluttering, like cleaning video. Maybe not tomorrow, but for sure next week we are going to tackle this closet. I probably will tidy it up right now, but I for sure need to declutter in here. I've already purged my closet when we moved in. I've told y'all this many times, but I know like deep down in my bones, I have like more purging to do. Like it just has to be done. So we're going to do that together sometime next week. I am going to go ahead and end the vlog here so I can just do my laundry and start editing this vlog so I can have it ready for you guys tomorrow morning. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog i hope that you guys enjoyed it also make sure to leave me any other suggestions on what i can gift for matthew thank you guys so much for watching this one and i will see you guys tomorrow for vlogmas day 16 bye